Hello, fellow engineers, and welcome to Fort. Oh my goodness, look how pointy this mouse thing is. You could have someone's eye out with that. Anyway, you guys have probably heard of Forts, but this is the new DLC High Seas. I've had many requests to play the original Forts, but never got round to it. Actually, that's a lie. I did have one little go. And the trouble is, when I got to this screen where I was picking my commander, I was scrolling down, and I was like, oh, look, there's someone in a hard hat. That sounds like me. What? How in Paddy's good name is that an architect? They've got a hard hat because they care about their safety. They've got elbow and knee pads because they're obviously doing hard labor and they don't want to damage those parts of their body. <laughs> They've got a huge oversized spanner. All I can assume is that was a typo. Well, not happy with this, but we're going to stick with the architect, I guess. Ugh, how am I going to explain this to Paddy? Anyway, let's get into it. All right, so here we are. If you played forts before, you may notice we're now on the sea. Yes, and all these boats, they have buoyancy physics and they float. So you've got to build equally. Otherwise, you'll topple over, etc. Uh, but I need to build pretty quickly because the game gets pretty intense pretty quickly. So we're just going to build a flat platform there uh, just so we can build up afterwards. I'm going to go in two devices. We're going to get a load of propellers underneath here. Now these don't actually move you. Unfortunately you can't move any closer to the enemy who are already building. Oh god we've got to be quick. We've got to be quick. Uh, they just gain you extra metal and things. Uh, ah they're already shooting me the bastards. Right we're going to put a load of machine guns in just to hopefully shoot down any missiles and things that may come this way. I'm then going to head over to this ship. Yes, we got two ships in this. We're going to get some technology on the go. The workshop. And then, oi, stop shooting me. And then these are the power cores. Yes, boats are nuclear powered in this universe. So we really need to try and protect that. So we're going to build up quite a few times. We're basically building a massive chimney. Because on the top of this, we're literally going to put smokestacks. Now these get us power, another resource we need. You can see our power on the bottom right. It's going up quite nicely. Uh, so we'll spend some on an armory. That just allows us to unlock some more good stuff. Yeah, and then we'll get an upgrade center as well. We may as well go all out. Basically, the more of these technology things we build, the more upgrades we get. Oh, look, we've actually unlocked a few more. Munitions plant. I think we're going to go for that. We're going to go for 20 mil cannons as our main sort of offensive weapon. So I'll shove that at the back. You can see the boat rocks. It's so cool. And then can you see over here, we've got these three planes. Yes, they are warthogs. We can actually launch them if we go into weapons and we build a runway, which we can actually build underwater. <laughs> Cool, okay, I'm just going to build that there. And then we're all good. Oh, we've also got the flat cannons on lock. So these are really good against like missiles and planes that they might send over. I think we'll shove a few of those down. I'm actually going to build over those. So we're building up just so our planes can't get hurt. And I might just put some more flat cannons on this as well. So we've got quite a lot of air defense, but I think we still need more. There's a very cool weapon here, the energy dome. So if we shove a couple of those down, you might see... Look, they've just sent a plane over. Oh, I've got rinsed. How are those guys looking actually? Not too bad. Okay. Yeah, we can choose to shoot these weapons, the flat cannons. I can just like shoot. That uses up energy and stuff. Hence, we need to be a bit careful. That went flying. It didn't even hit their ships. <laughs> Right, anyway, up on our big tower here, let's start getting the 20 mil cannons. So if we can put one of these on every level, they should do a bit of damage. So we've got three of those being built. They're trying to send planes over. They are not getting through our flat cannons. We have so many. It's beautiful. Uh, and you can see we're actually ready to launch some E-10. So these back here, they're not actually like the runway. This is the runway that launches the plane. And these are just the ammo. So if we go into the ammo tab, we can actually build more of these. And this will just be how many planes we can send at once. So if we get all of those in, we're pretty good. Yeah, I am actually going to shield this ship a little bit as well. I'm going to build an energy dome. I think to go at the front. So that should protect it a little bit. All right, and then 20 mil cannons. We can decide where to shoot these. So we'll just go in the middle and see where that goes. Oh, it's a little bit short. So next time we got to aim a little bit higher. So this one, we're going to shoot. Oh God, there's a missile coming in. We took it out, thankfully. Oh, look, we are doing some damage to their ship. We did a lot of damage. 20 mil cannons for the wind. In. Right, one at the bottom. Where's this one going to go? Probably about there. Why aren't you shooting? Oh, there's no door in front. Right, you need to put doors in. Otherwise, you can't shoot. Can you see these two? They have doors. We'll shoot that one in the same spot. And we'll do the bottom one as well. And then we'll go over. Oh, that was a bit short. 
We are doing a bit of damage though, and we can try and send some planes over. So I think these have a sort of limit on where they bomb. Yeah, we are getting some bombing runs in, doing the damage, although that didn't do a lot of damage. I'm not sure how good they are actually. Like they look cool, but I think we're better off just using the 20 mil cannons. So they need to fire a little bit further. How's that one looking? Oh yeah, that one's good. We've actually set the top of that ship on fire. Let me just shoot this last one and we'll go have a look. Look, it is on fire. Oh yes, taking the damage. Uh, there's another thing I want to unlock though. So if we go into technology, we can build this, the factory. We'll shove that down there. We're going to keep firing these for now. You can see our ship actually rocks back when we shoot. Right, look at this. Ready? Whoa! Oh, it's on the lean. <laughs> All right, so we are peppering that front ship. Ooh, where is the core? Where is the core? That's what I want to know. Oh, they're shooting back, though. They're using our own tactics against us. Such an architect move. All right, anyway, more cannon fire. Oh, they're, they're repairing quickly. Oh, we just blew up their smokestack, though. That means they're not producing any energy, although they are on this back one. Just do some hits with this bottom one. All right, they're, they're trying to shoot a missile at us. Oh, it's going through. It's getting through. Oh, whew. That was close. That was close. You can see this shield thing, though, doing the business. Ah, you prick. Put those fires out. Right, that's quite annoying. We lost a few flat cannons there. Uh, but I'll tell you what we're going to do. We're going to buy a fire beam and we're going to shove it there. And then I'm going to keep firing these just to annoy them. I don't want them to think I'm going easy on them. And I'm going to build another 20 mil cannon to go on this floor. And then, oh god. Oh, that was close. That was very close. We did lose our other shield thing. So I think I might get an energy dome. One to go at the back there. And if we press this button, I think we build things quicker. So yeah, this is nearly done now. This is going to do some damage. You're going to love it. Right, let's fire these first just to wind them up. We do now have four, which is awesome. What sort of damage is that doing? Oh, it's doing quite a bit of damage. Oh, they are annihilated. Right, and now we click on this one. This is a fire beam. This will set fire. Look at that. Oh, it is melting. We've actually exposed their core. If we can get a few more hits. All right, come on, 20 mil cannons. We've just got to fire in the same spot. Yes, yes. We destroyed one of their ships. Look at the nuclear chaos in the middle. Right, now we've just got this big boy at the back. Oh, and he has some weapons. Thankfully, we have destroyed that. Uh, shall we set him on fire? I think we might do. So if we do aim that about there, you'll see this sets fire to the ship. And if they don't put it out quick enough, he will lose everything above it. Oh, yes. Oh, he put it out. He put it out. All right, next up, I'm going to go a little bit mental on the old ammo. So we've got loads of A10s. They weren't the best. We could try and get some Nighthawks in, though. I think let's do a bit of both. So we'll build a load of these. Proper just fill up the ship. And then, of course, we will keep firing. We need to fire a bit further now because the ship is way at the back. Was that? far enough yeah not too bad not too bad we'll fire all these 20 mils and then we'll fire this fire beam yes get them on fire oh something blew up in there i think that might be ammo storage love to see it and then i will just be launching a crap ton of a10s at him yeah, but that does sort of mean i need to take out their air defenses so I need some sort of missile-y thing. Marine swarm missiles? That sounds quite fun. I'm not entirely sure how they work, but if we shove that, I don't know, there. We better repair our ship, actually. Let's take some damage. Oh, we can upgrade this thing. I didn't I didn't even see that. We can upgrade that to a deck gun. I think we'll do that. And I think a lot of these guns, they require a sniper to sort of be able to set the target. So maybe I'll shove a sniper, like, on the front there. All right, I'm going to do a bit more damage to the ship. I'm a bit worried... We've gone a bit soft on him. Let's set him on fire and then hit them with these. Oh, look at the fire spreading. It is beautiful. Oh, look, they got a cheeky flat cannon at the front. Well, I don't know what they've just fired. Three shots, though. Will they go over us? Ah! He took out a chimney. Cheeky bastard. Right, chimney goes up there. And we're back in business. This deck gun is nearly upgraded. Looking forward to seeing what that does. And uh, let's set him on fire again. Because all the time he's repairing, he's not growing, which is what we want to see. Right, firing the 20 mils again. I think this one needed to go a lot higher. Oh yeah, that's good. That did some damage. And he's still on fire. He hasn't put it out yet. I'll tell you what, let's make his day even worse. Let's set something low down on fire. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Love to see it. Right, now our deck gun is complete. I don't know where we want to aim for this. Not a clue. But we'll get to see if we fire far enough what his defenses are like in terms of anti-aircraft. They're not that bad. And that shot... Not too bad. 
if we just do a little bit more power next time, we should be good. So that's reloading. How many A10s do we... Oh, they're all ready. That's the last one. I think we're just going to lease him with A10s. We'll use this with a bit more power to boost. That should set off the anti-aircraft defenses, which means we can then set these off. So A10, the first one might get mullered, but after that, we should be a bit better. If we just keep sending them over. Yeah, we are doing the damage. Look at that. It's getting bombed to hell. Oh, and again. All right, now we fire the cannons. We're going to do all of them at once. And the big one. And we've blown it up. Yes. Yes. <laughs> you don't know how hard this game is. <laughs> it took so long. This is my first victory. Oi, I'm trying to build here. All right, everything I've built has been destroyed. That's fine. That's fine. <laughs> game. Stop doing this to me. They're still firing at us. This game's not fair. Oh, and the front of our ship's on fire. Okay. What was that? Oh, no. There's definitely strategies you need to learn. And this one was the 20 mil cannon just mullering everything. Uh, new A10s, though. Pretty fun. I really like the buoyancy physics. We'll have to play with sort of building things and seeing how it works in another video. But if you like this, guys, boost the like button. I'll catch you guys next time. Peace, love, and instant replays of it getting blown up. Love to see it. Love to see it.